the University of Valencia Science Park is researched. So I did most of my elementary school abroad. So I got to uh, study a little bit in Canada, in Belgium, in France. But I did all my superior education in Paris, in Versailles. And I've always been interested in science. I think one of the main drivers was my curiosity. Uh, it was always fascinating to me to uh, study new methods that would allow us to expand our knowledge of the species. So I think this is the reason why I got into sciences. I guess two reasons. The first one, the beach. Uh, I mean, for someone from Paris, like having a beach is very exotic and the good weather. But more seriously, it has to do with the quality of the lab here. So I knew already that uh, Rafa and Pilar were working on uh, phages. So I just wanted to be around this very booming uh, field and very active team. So the combination of both was just perfect. I did my high school in a, uh, in Versailles, in uh, the Lycée La Boya. So it's tailored for a scientist. They have a very specific section for them. And then I did my university at Paris Descartes. And there I studied biomedical sciences, uh, genomics, and bioinformatics as well. Uh, now I'm uh, at the University of Valencia, working at the uh, Idosis Bio, and uh, doing my PhD thesis on uh, phages, bacteriophages, and how we can apply uh, AI methods to resolve questions related to phages. Yeah, so my work is focused on bacteriophages, and there are a type of viruses. We tend to believe that viruses are bad. You know, we have the example of COVID or the flu virus, but this is actually not the case. Uh, bacteriophages are a class of viruses that are very interesting for us as humans because they can target bacteria. And this is especially relevant when it comes to bacteria that are drug resistant. So a drug resistant bacteria is a bacteria that had developed some resistance against antibiotics, right? And this is something that could be very problematic if we leave the misuse of antibiotics continue. Um, so an alternative to it would be using bacteriophages that can then <coughs> kill bacteria to tackle this issue. And my line of research specifically is about how uh, bacteriophage can infect bacteria that expresses what we call a capsule. A capsule can be thought as a pocket in which the bacteria is going to hide and protect itself from the immune system or antibiotics. So it gets into the capsule and stays in your body. But bacteriophages can infect and recognize the capsule and kill effectively the bacteria. So my line of research specifically is aimed at understanding better how the phage can target a capsule, degrade it, and then get access to, to the bacteria. I find it very exciting to be in this environment because this Eosis Bio Park is such a multidisciplinary environment where you get to meet a lot of people doing very different kind of research. And this can really expand your scope on your own research and bring you new perspectives that you couldn't have remaining in your own uh, domain, right? And I guess the second advantage would be how fast-paced and how uh, quickly Valencia evolves as a city. And there's a lot of in innovation, a lot of science going on. And we get to meet with a lot of people from all around the world and share science with people in the U.S., in Belgium, Australia. And that just really expands your scope and really make you feel like your science and your work matters. So another reason would be the quality of the equipment that we are provided with. So we get to do very top-notch research in science, supercomputers, uh, very advanced P2 labs. Uh, where we get to tackle very exciting questions.